All right, number two, solve for m, multi multiple answers separated by comma. So again, this is what we call factored form. We have the first factor is 11m minus 3, and the second factor is 23m minus 15. So when you're in factored form, you always want the equal 0. That's really important because we can set each factor equal to 0. We have to have it equal 0. If it's not equal 0, we're going to have to multiply it out and solve, but this one's equal 0, so we're good. And now we're going to solve each equation. So I want m by itself. That's the goal. So I'm going to add 3 to both sides. Divide both sides by 11. So m equals 3 over 11. Then for this side, we're going to start by adding 15. And then divide both sides by 23. And we're just going to leave it as fractions because it doesn't say to round. That means we want exact answers. So here's our two answers. We have two answers because it's a quadratic. If we were to multiply those, we would get an m squared. And that 2 tells us how many answers we're going to have. So 3 divided by 11, comma, 15 divided by 23.